Well, call me the last man on earth because I am about to get raptured. Hello, Internet. Praise be to God, and welcome back to Seblems. So, we are on the final of the main difficulty ranks, Rapture, which is the hardest rank of them all. And this is the point of the series where I'm anticipating I'm only going to get through about one level per video. I'm just expecting that going in so I can try to enjoy these as much as possible without getting bogged down by being like, oh no, I can't only get one level done in a video. So we're on level one. Aha! Real monsters! Oh, this is a Seb This is a Meg Sebites level. I recognize this one. This had really cool design for the Martian tile set. Not really a fan of the Martian tile set, though. Not really a fan of any of the Lemmings Plus free tile sets, except the circuit one's alright. Well, oh boy. So that's a trap. I love all the monsters you guys made out of the terrain. It's really cool. Hey, guys. Alright, so float her down there, find a way around the trap. <laughs> the rapture levels are probably where I need to start actually going into the levels with a plan. <laughs> but I'm not gonna do that. We can kill a lemming, so maybe we just kill the first lemming out. <laughs> or maybe we'll kill that guy. We've got quite a few destructive skills, so that's nice. So the lemmings are just nice and stuck back there. Got all the time in the world. Okay, alright. So we'll probably have to mine them out here. That's not great. Let's see. So we're going to need a basher at the end. Basher miner there. And if you guys are wondering what that sound is, that's the wind outside. It is incredibly windy out today. So windy that my tennis shoes are essentially functioning like Air Jordans. They are not Air Jordans. Alright. Um, seems like a I need to get up here, basically. I need to get up at the top of this. Which means I'm probably going to need to get up there, which means I'm probably going to need to get up there. And that's going to take a lot. Two platformers to get across? I don't know about that. That seems very wasteful. And we can't even combine that with a... S well, maybe we could combine that with two stackers, but again, seems too wasteful. Well, that could actually could work. I don't see a lot of use for the stackers anyway, so... That's just... that's what I'm tentatively gonna go with. That's no fun. Hmm, how can I turn this around? But um, I could use another platformer, but that might be a bit wasteful. Because we're going to need two platformers across there. Probably two to get across there, unless... Nah, we don't need that. Alright. I'm 
we're probably doing this wrong. I'm just gonna come out and say it. I'm probably doing this wrong. So you go for this shebane. Oh, really? Oh, the trigger area is low on that. Okay. If only I could save a stacker for there, but then I'd use an extra platformer. And that's not good. Maybe I could save a platformer there. Like if I could get everybody up there. Well, no, that would still take three platformers anyways, so no. Trying to confuse me. Hi guys, my name is Marvin and I'm a monster. There's no real way to turn him around except for a platformer. Then he can bash through there. Yeah, that's the problem. Well, one of the problems. <laughs> So I obviously have to rethink something, and it's probably this section right there. Hmm. This definitely is a tough one. Purpose does the trap there preserve? I bet I'm not using the diggers properly at all. I also can take up two more climbers, so that's probably going to be something as well. Hmm. What could the two extra climbers be good for? I'll make that guy float. Well, that's barely even gonna slow him down. Unless I make him a climber as well. That's a clever little trick. Definitely like that. And now we saved an extra guy. What could that be useful for? I mean, the trap works probably too fast in order for one woman to get across, but... I suppose we could try it. Now it's just gonna be a matter of when to let the guy go. May as well get things started. Ooh, we 
get heaven. Well, no, only if only if floaters can survive that, anyways. So that plan won't even work. I feel like we could dig down through there. And then double platform across. Yep, that is perfect for one digger. Surely that's gotta be on the right track. Oh, and we can just bash through all of that. Yes, please. You can mine at the end. Yeah, then we can use a platformer there and then save our upper platformer for over there. I still don't know, because obviously we need to send a floater down there, and he has to find some way to survive the trap. And we can't use a platform or a stacker with the way that things are right now, so... Hmm. Problem is, I, I stand by, like, almost... Maybe that's not right. We're also going to get someone who turns around. At least if we use the single platformer across there. Oh, never mind, we're even a platformer short as is. What a pickle. Way we could be less wasteful over there, maybe? That's small enough that we could probably use two stackers to get across there, but not everyone would be able to get up that. That doesn't go far enough at all. Hmm. This is a tough one. Make no mistake about that. We could use a stacker at the beginning. Just seal them all in and we won't go down. Let's try that. Cause he'll make it through. He can platform at the very end, and he lands on there. Oh, that's both our stackers done, though. That's true. Oh, that wouldn't even be thick enough anyways. That would be just not thick enough. Hmm. Deceptively tricky one here.
Maybe I'm thinking about this all wrong. Maybe we make them all go on the top. Because we can platform across there and then, like, dig down. And then bash. Platform again, bash for all that. Well... I mean, yeah, maybe that whole thing's just a red herring anyways. forget how fast stackers are. But of course they're just slow enough so that a lemming will always go over. Yeah, so what if we did something like this? Okay, that's not as far as I would have liked, but maybe we can fix that. You see that, what I'm getting at though, right? Like mine down, they all climb up to the top of layer. So at this point we will have three platforms left. There's only one there, one there, one there. So we are out of platforms to use. stuck at the bottom. Yeah, they'll climb up that. Seems like it's yep too thick. Six. Not even close. New plan if we use two platformers over on this end. Well. No, I don't think that's going to work. I don't think this plan is going to work at all, actually. So it's back to the drawing board. This seems really right to do. That just seems so perfect. Yeah. 
yeah, it doesn't even work in the first place. Because on this level, it's hard to tell what is what parts of the terrain are crucial for the solution and what parts are just there for decoration. Like this guy right here. It almost looks like it serves a purpose, but it doesn't. Alright, we're gonna need a lot of miners. Actually, what's the rush? We've got all the time in the world. We can do that and let them all up to here, which is pretty good. Ah, uh, nope. Basher tunnels are taller than stacks. So I'm on the, almost wondering, can we do some crazy thing here with the basher and stackers? And there's no way of, of forcing the lemmings through there. Also, why did I think I could kill somebody? I can't kill anybody. So that just means avoid the traps at all costs. So if I save a stacker for there, they can turn around and bash. Platform, bash, platform. Here's something. That bill. Can I stack up here if I platform from down there? Yeah, but they can't climb up. But it was worth a try. That would have been really cool if I could. Boom, 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 boom. boom. Hmm. It's this part here that makes me very worried. Ugh. 
trying to think of like crazy out of the box solutions, but I'm not seeing a whole lot. So I've got, I am very confident I've done this beginning part right. I'm very confident in that. So I've got five platformers left. At the very least, I'm going to need two for there. Like there's no way around it. I will need two for there. However, the rest are pretty flexible, and I'm going to need... Eventually. Alright, so digger's not gonna work. Maybe a miner? the diggers for, really. Not a whole lot. So I'll just use the digger like that. I'll need to go a bit lower than that, of course. Now he should turn. Yeah, yeah, there we go. This is where we're going to use our other digger. Okay.
So now I'm trying to think. So we'll need actually. Cool. So the exit has been carved. Or the path to the exit has been carved. Now we still have some other stuff. So what to do? We'll need... Send a lemming basically up while that guy's platforming, so he goes down here. Well, because I was thinking, use a stacker here to seal that gap, because I think that's just free pixels. Yeah, so a stacker would seal that gap. And then you could mine through there, bash through all of this. Then they'd be up here, and then we can use something to get them down there. Alright. Places where we could save a bash, or I guess we could have there at the beginning. Okay. Change of plan, gentlemen. gonna be the athlete. Wait a second, we don't need the digger. He can just turn around and walk back. So we can save the digger there. He's going to have a long walk all the way around, but that's okay. Oh, that's not going to work. Rats. I was really hoping that would work. In fact, that's too clever to not work. There's gotta be something I'm missing. So four bashers. We're gonna need one basher for along there. We're gonna need one to get through there. One to get through there. So we have one basher, essentially, that we can spare. And we'll probably need one there. As for the miners, we're gonna need one for here. And... Uh, one for there. Oh, cool. Oh, 
Gotta admit, this is a really awesome level. Because there's so much stuff you can do, but there's only like one right thing to do. So now you save everybody, and now they're all going to be trapped in here. I think this will work. I really hope this will work. Because this is a very clever use of a lot of stuff. Now we can do that. Now you can mine down there. Now the last guy here can dig through there. And everyone should now go to the exit. That was a beautiful level. So well done. That was just fantastic and a great start to the Rapture rank. I love that so much! Beautiful architecture, great puzzle. That was awesome, Flopsy. And Wafflem, because I know you guys both did it. And, like I thought, only time for one uh, level for this episode. So... I guess we'll just have to see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. I'm Colorful Artie, and as a special treat, I will have a guest speaker for the next episode. Have a great day, and God bless.